Hey yeah, guys, Tez Reptiles here, and <clears throat> today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I set up my cricket farm. Now, I'm not sure if you've seen this, these cages before, but they're just a little, um, like a lunch, like a just a little container thing. But yeah, this is what we have going on so far. Oh, dear, this is bad. Don't want them to go everywhere. But, um, yeah, here they are. They're just adult crickets that I brought from the pet store. I think they are seven fifty for all these. So what we have here is a couple hides. I'm sure there's plenty under there. Yep. And there'll be heaps under there as well. But, yeah, so... I'm going to try to breed them to get a healthy population up for next season because I'm getting some animals that need to eat these. So what I'm feeding them on um, is just apples. They got their water thing down there. The lady at pet store told me um, just to have a wet cloth and then they drink off that. But yeah, there they are. I got this little thing here for egg laying and whatever else I want to do but yeah um, that's really my setup um, I think there's about 30 or 50 30 to 50 she said so yeah that's pretty good but yeah thank you all very much for watching this is just so that they can lay their eggs and when they hatch I'll probably Put, in, put them into separate enclosures and then just build the population up and so on and so forth. Now what else I would feed them? Um, I just feed them oranges, um, just any kind of fruits or berries and all that. So, yeah. Um, also yesterday I fed them to a couple of my blue tongues and actually the little baby one that we have actually ate one which was pretty exciting but yeah thank you all very much for watching this video that's how I set up my enclosure and yeah I'll see you on the next one